because Treasury Secretary nominee and former Federal Reserve Chairman Janet Yellen is going to be testifying on the Hill this morning. She is expected to urge Congress to pass more coronavirus stimulus in order to avoid a recession. What are you expecting in terms of a uh, reaction in markets uh, from Yellen's testimony this morning? There's been a lot of reaction already because now we're talking about another $1.9 trillion in spending on top of the fact that we had $3 trillion at the beginning of the pandemic, another $900 billion in December, and we could get a multi-billion dollar infrastructure deal sometime in the next two years. And I think the market's kind of already voted on this, the fact that we're already seeing inflationary pressure, Maria. Like, you're already seeing interest rates go up. You're already seeing commodity prices go up. But I think the more remarkable thing about this is we already know what consumers and businesses are going to do with this money. They're going to sit on it. If you look at quarter over quarter, we've seen another 8% increase in deposits. We're up to like $2.1 trillion now sitting in cash. And if you look at companies right now, I mean, they're more flush with cash than they've ever been historically, like 8% of their balance sheet right now is sitting in cash if you take financials out of it. And we know consumers right now are just hoarding that cash, which says to me, we're going to see a huge spending boom sometime later this year, because as the economy reopens, we know Americans love to spend money. That money's going to start getting spent. But also, you know, if you look at corporate CEOs, they're going to look at earnings are going up. I'm sitting on all this cash. We just talked about buybacks. They're going to keep happening. You're going to start seeing capital expenditure on top of that and research and development. So we're just going to see a bona fide spending boom sometime later this year. And I think the market's already telling you financials are up big. My man, Dennis Gartman, is always talking about financials. They're up over 19 percent the last quarter and material stocks as well. So, you know, going back to what Mark said, this is why you want to diversify right now, because other parts of the market are really starting to move and they're starting to move predicated on all this spending.